Hi guys, this is take two. I turned it on a minute ago, it was so blurry you couldn't see anything. You couldn't even tell that was a saw. Well, as I said in that last video, I don't have a whole lot going on here, so um, I guess I'll show you sharpening a few teeth. Um, I just use a file, these are just regular old steel teeth. I got you up here, I guess I, guess I should have stood back and showed you where I was. I've got the place fairly cleaned up. I've got uh, everything blown off. Those I'm just gonna burn in the burn barrel. I have enough boards to do the next um, thing. Uh, I should have cleaned in the sawdust pit a little bit more. I got the slab woods down there. I'm gonna come up and put them in my green bucket and take them down to my wood splitter that I don't move because I can take anything to the same spot. And then I'll, I think I'll bust them in half because some of them are a little bit big. Anyhow, we're gonna put you right here. And, um, uh-oh, I hit a button. Nothing seemed to happen. I think we're gonna put you right there. Uh-oh, showing battery. I, now I took this, I took this um, battery right out of the charger before I came here. So I don't know how long you'll see this. But generally, I just sit down here, pull my legs. Sometimes I mark these. I can't see where my crayon is behind me. We'll, uh, we'll mark it here. That's why I didn't oil the blade down. And I forget which one of these is the most sharp. One's uh, this one, this pretty aggressive one there. Um, but I just touch them up like that, and it's it's sharp. That's all it takes. Sometimes you got to take more. Need a little bit on this side. There you go. Now it's nice and flat. You can you really can't see what I'm talking about. But there's there's a shiny part there that you can get and that's all I do to touch these blades up. And you can feel them. They'll they'll cut you now. Here they're dull. They won't do nothing to you there. It doesn't take too long to go through a, a set. I pull my leg against it to keep them tight so it doesn't wobble all over creation. And I wish I could bring you down to show you the before and after. Maybe I'll try to do that. I guess it hadn't shut off yet. Um, uh, let's see if I can do that. I'm going to have to set you down in between. Nah, it's not focusing in. I don't know what it's focusing on. Oh, um, maybe I, I'm too far in. I'm not too good with this camera. There we go. I must have had it too focused in. I hope it was clear enough that you could see what was going on up there. It's still not focusing in. Anyhow, you can see the difference between that and here's one that's dull. And it, it looks about the same to me on, in the camera. Anyhow, um, I don't know where, I've got to put you back up there, I guess. I can't hold the camera and run both ends of the file to keep it straight at the same time. Huh. So I'll do a few here. That, that battery thing's still flashing at me for no, no good reason. <sighs> Sometimes I measure the width, sometimes I don't. You can certainly see the difference down here, like th this one here is dull. I don't want to do that with a sharp one. Oh, I don't have my leg in there right. Now 
That was a little bit was a little bit goofy. And I uh I go through quite a few files. There ain't nothing you know how you don't like sawing a, sawing a log with your chainsaw with a dull chain. You don't like filing your sawmill blade with a dull file. And you gotta get them pretty straight across there. When they're straight, that little that little shiny part that you can't see, you can really tell it's straight. And it's grinding. I don't know if you can see all this grinding on my legs already. Carbide tips are good. I'm just not into them. Don't ask me why, but I'm not into them. On this saw, anyway. I have one of those um, Atlas grinders. I also have a couple jockey grinders and stuff like that. But you know, it's just about as easy to do it this way. I never got the jockey grinder to where I liked it, like the way it ground. Um, I've seen some people on YouTube that are real good with those jockey grinders. Mark has got uh, an air grinder. I don't know what it is for his carbides. I think it's air. I'm pretty sure it's air grinder. You know, I, can you see me dripping? And, uh...